Peel Thunder have fallen by three points after a late South Fremantle goal in the final moments at David Gray's Arena. It was a scrappy affair in slippery conditions, with the two teams locked in an arm wrestle for the majority of the match. But despite a three goal effort from Cam McCarthy, Peel were unable to seal a win, finishing 11 5 71 to 10 14 74. The Thunder went blow for blow with the tough Bulldogs team all day, until a goal by South Fremantle's Nick Subin in the final minute of the game sealed the Thunder's fate. Defender Toby Watson, one appeals best on ground with 25 disposals and a game high 15 marks, said the loss is devastating. We thought we put in good effort throughout the game, especially after quarter time and after half time we really dug in, the boys really uh, worked really hard and to go down by three points, uh, yeah, it breaks your heart a little bit, yeah. The first term saw both teams struggling in the unfavourable conditions, neither able to gain the ascendancy as the high marking affair had little impact on the scoreboard with wayward kicking from the Bulldogs keeping Peel close at quarter time. The Bulldogs then threatened to break away multiple times throughout the second and third quarters, swamping the Peel backline with entry after entry as the lead hit 20 points three times in the third term alone. Speaking after the match, Watson said the effort put in by the young Peel backline is a good indicator of the direction the team is heading. It just shows our resilience as a, as a young team, so it, it would have been easy just to fold over and uh, they could have run away with it. Obviously they're a very uh, top end side, so, uh, and we're, we're a very young team, so they could have rolled over us, but it just shows our resilience to get back into the game and ended up being nine points up at one stage in the last quarter and to go down is obviously really disappointing, but it shows great grit from the, from the boys. Led through the midfield by Travis Collier and Lachlan Schultz, who had 48 touches between them, Peel weathered the pressure coming from the Bulldogs before going on a five goal run either side of the final change. Tempers flared in the final term as the game intensity went up another level, but Stowalt defence from Peel combined with inaccurate kicking in front of goal from the Bulldogs meant the result wasn't decided until the final minute of the game. The Thunder now turn their attention to Perth, who they play next week on June 22nd at 2.15pm at Mineral Resources Park. Tim Davies, Docker TV.